world. Welcome back to an episode. We have armor. Oh, yeah. And we are going to use that armor to the fullest of its capabilities. And kind of forgot that there's still those two thingamajigs in my inventory. So let's just quickly move them to, uh, well, actually out of here. So wait a minute. That one goes to beast. And that one goes to the, uh, the beast. The other kind of beast. The beast of burden. Right. And now we can continue to uh, look around here and uh, see what those taverns actually have in, in store for us. Let's see. The Toy Master's shop. Oh, this Toy Master. Sanders. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. I could just walk around and uh, try to get as much of it as possible. The only thing I have to do is make sure that the door is always closed. Uh, make sure that the doors are always closed. There we go. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. This dude is just insane. Uh, Alright. Question. Wait a minute. The bewitched Moppet. <laughs> what is this? The puppet looks at you with what almost amounts to curiosity. You sense power from within it. A measure of source, just enough to make the plaything seem alive. Seem alive is good. This thing is a vision goat. Uh, just say. Can it be that I know this guy? I think you might be my favorite. Shh, don't tell the others. Somehow this voice also seems very, very familiar. Very weird. All right. Uh, let's save this and this. And what else can I open up, though? Because I don't want to interact with, like, every little workbench thingy in here. I just need specific ones. I mean, the metal scrap can be up to... Like, yeah, metal scrap is good for, like, other room crafting or whatnot. But to be honest, I don't think I need that much now, right? Pretty much good to go. Only thing I need is uh, to make sure to uh, get another one of those claw hammers. But no, the claw hammer is not that important. Hmm. I think we got it. Uh, I think we got it. Maybe this one? Yeah, there we go. That is pretty much it. The other way would be to maybe turn the puppet around if that's working. Only thing I have to do is they go sideways a little bit. The puppet looks at you. Nah, it doesn't do much. All right, so but the rest of the room is still good for the taking. La da dee da 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 do. Why do I even take this toy thingy? I don't need it. Hmm, it would be funny to have some kind of version uh, or like way of turning normal uh, or like. No, the other way around. <laughs> a way of turning toy weapons and shields into actual working and useful kind of things. That would be cool. Claws of Deceit. What is this? Oh, a nice book to read. Mm, Metats Blood Rose Notes. Ooh. Medats, not Metats. Medats. Medatati. Medatatu. And there are even more books around. Look at that. Uh, as a bit of parchment. But you could actually try to play this game as... Um... Oh no. What's what's going on? Let's take our leave. And... Uh, uh, try to talk your way out of the situation. And we are going for the bribe, of course. Just to make things easier on us. Alright, problem solved. So... <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't even know if that was worth it or not. Uh, we got a decent amount of like, normal items and so on. Yeah, the toy thingy probably can be sold or whatnot. Uh, what about this history of Pucker Rex? And the soon humored this story and assembles the bulk of what is still known to the large world about the infamous Pucker Rex. Uh, creates a lightly drawn potential that feels somewhat incomplete, but it also carries the ring of truth. Pucker was once a fine human being, a noble ruler, but his greed overtook him and became corrupted. Yada yada yada, something, something, Cassandra, and so on and so forth. Maybe this is how Dallas controls him. Maybe he thinks that she is Cassandra. Legend tells of the most precious rose, the blood rose, prized by kings and men from ancient times. The blood rose grows only in soils of useless 
uh, suffering and fertilized with filth. In the days of Pacus Rex, the rose was grown using methods as a Terrig and Vaya, the only method proven to grow the rare blossom. The perfumer a wainal persuaded Bracus to bury the bones of the tortured dead within a deep cave. He sowed the seeds within their emptied skulls, watering with their tears of tortured living in such a soil of the blood rose flourish. The scholars say that even today, were you to find this mystical cave, uh, the roses would grow there still. And I found it, and I also got it. Pretty interesting. Cloth of Deceit. Bed by eight. Yeah, we got that one. Alrighty. So now let's talk to the Toy Master. Maybe he has some interesting things for us. Daddy's going to fix you right up. A visitor. Tell me, do you like puppets? Kind of depends. I admit that you do, if they work well, of course. Hmm. The toy seller nods and smiles. Wonderful. Here, take a look at this. The puppet springs to life. Hmm. Impressive, no? There's a lot of craftsmanship in that small package. Quite a lot. Now, what can I do for you? I haven't had many callers of late, what with all the fuss and hubbub that's been going on outside. Hmm. Okay, we are going to ask us where's light. Oh. Let's just wonder how he brought that puppet to life. Looks like source magic. Source? What else? Each and every one of my darlings has a little bit of magic in them. It turns a mere toy into a friend. Or avoid Vulcan enemy that's going to rip out your heart. I wonder how he avoided Magister's persecution. They controlled the city until recently, after all. I'm on good terms with the Divine Order. They know what my work entails. They've even had use for me in the past. I have nothing to fear from them. The path of blood thing, right? Ask if he isn't afraid that Void Vulcan will be attracted to his source. Oh, no, not at all. I use only the smallest sprinkle of source in my work. I'd hardly think a Void Vulcan would set its sights on me and my darlings. Hmm. Ask where his interest in Puppet came from. I love my work. I love the possibilities of it all. The idea of engineering something to perfection. But one aspect always fails me. People. Fallible, mortal, irrational people. He throws an adoring glance to one of the puppets. My darlings aren't like that. They are pure and beautiful. They don't make mistakes. And they don't question my desires. I don't need others anymore i have something better hmm okay ask if it's true that he designed the path of blood myself and others some of the finest feats of engineering ever conceived guard the remains of the divine the path of blood was our masterpiece hmm interesting way of naming it now i'm the last one alive the last engineer of the cathedral and its secrets i've retired and found a new calling these wondrous darlings one of my late colleagues designed them for the cathedral little wind-up sentries to guard against intruders <laughs> Now I busy myself turning the surplus into toys. It truly feels good to spread a little joy in my twilight years. Hmm. Now what can you tell me about the cathedral and Lucian's tomb? It is a feat of engineering. A modern marvel, unmatched in quality anywhere in the realm. I should know, as it is my greatest work to date. But you should broach more practical matters with Lord Protector Ahu, the Keeper of the Cathedral. You should find him in his chambers there. No, oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, uh, anything more we? about the... Uh... Nah, there's nothing else there. Good. Consider me Two, at your service see. if you need anything else. That is kind of creepy, but anyway, we got the toy wooden blog and another toy wooden blog. There are like, why are there four different toy wooden blocks? What's the purpose of having four different toy wooden blocks in here? Anyway, there is also teleportation scrolls and neither swap and whatnot. He has very interesting kind of items. Very 
very out of the box kind of items. <laughs> All right. Uh, then there's also this other room up here. So let's just make sure that we're not getting seen here. All right. And in there we go. You! You're not supposed to be here! Ooh. Well, that was uh, kind of unexpected, isn't it? Ha! Huh. Oh, look at that. The bewitched Muppet. <laughs> you got to be kidding me. Anyway, uh, ask what's up here. Uh, That's none of your concern. Okay, well, we are on our way. Allow me. This way, I can be sure you don't go wandering on your way out. Let's see how often we can actually do that. <laughs> ah, that's so annoying. Okay, is there an another way in? Because there usually seems to be. Uh, let's see. The dog also has sniffed something strange. Like there... There could be a way up, like a ladder or something. But I do not see anything on the side that's high enough for us to climb onto. Uh, I mean, we could just climb on the stands here, but this is no Assassin's Creed. Hmm. So how would we go in there? Without getting seen. Let's see. This thing here turns like left side, right side, whatnot. Theory 5. And it's like going... They turn... Oh yeah, they do turn around. In a clockwise manner. Very interesting. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> Is there a way to check these things out, though? Uh, I think I'm gonna go up here. Am I safe now or not? Uh, even more Muppets. Uh, why are they called Muppets? <laughs> That's such a weird name. Alright, let's get the cheaper paper. Don't need those buckets now. There. There are two of those now. Alright. Um. Well, I could try to just defeat them on my own. Oh! Perfect. Let's save. Eh? Okay, that's kind of weird. Another one. The desk is locked tight. Instead of a keyhole, there's a gilded inlay that bears an engraving. It was all for you. Beneath this sits a framed square of blank parchment. Hmm, stand intently at that what are you parchment. What doing here? This is private. <sighs> Well, apology and say that you must have gotten lost. Yeah. My eye, you got lost. What are you really doing up here? <laughs> oh boy, I have no persuasion. Oh, that sucks. Um, claim that you've been tasked by the Ark authorities with a check there of its citizens. That's not going to work at all. Uh, say that he's a salesman, isn't he? If he didn't want people perusing his establishment, he <laughs> should know. Uh, say that what you were doing here is of no concern to it. You'd do well to forget all about it. Uh, mm, adequate measures in place to prevent burglaries. Oh, yes, yes. That, that sounds like fun, but it's probably not the one that works. Yeah, you need... Sa okay. You're nothing but a rotten interloper. I won't stand for this. Well, that kind of sucks. Um, I'm not going to fight this dude now because I, 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 for some reason, I don't want to be on his bad side, right? Uh, for now, he is okay. But the problem is, how do you get around the bloody Muppets? Um, like, I have to walk up there in peace, pretty much. That means uh, maybe even invisibility and whatnot. Uh, I have to figure that out somehow. All right. 
Nah, it's just normal things. And even more of those cubes. Alright, what what is this book all about? Normal book. Painting of the man. Da 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 da. Telekinesis is quite useful. One has to say. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Uh, an inquiry on rare source relics. Oh. That's an interesting read. Okay, so I have to go up here and I have to figure out how to do this safely. Hmm. Wait a minute. I do know how to do this safely, don't I? <laughs> uh, but how can I... Can I do this the right way? Hmm. Because I have to make them blind somehow. Or defeat them, or whatever. Let's see. Maybe there's a... Where's this guy? Yeah. You're positively haunting me with your mm. presence of late. Something I can help you with? Yeah, yeah, yeah. About the moving puppets. Source, what else? Each and every one of my darlings has a little bit of magic. Yeah, yeah, we get this one. What about the puppet I interest? I love my work. People are fallible. Okay. My darlings aren't like that. They are I pure and beautiful. Get they most don't make of mistakes, that. All right. They don't question my desires. I don't need others anymore. I. Okay, wait a minute. What would happen if we were to let's see? Uh, get seen by this dude if he is still in dialogue right now. Does he get teleported up? Do we have gotten ourselves... Oh. Oh. Seems well here. Okay, so this is a safe spot. Good to know. Um, hmm. I just need a thief to do this now. I need a way to do this as a thief. That actually means feign. Um, that means feign. We told you you could touch that. Wait, what touch? Touch what? So, let's see. Some interesting axes, but they have probably nothing to do with it. Military essays. What makes an expert swordsman? There are three types of swordsmen, yada yada yada. Um, you don't teach them anything, basically. That's what they say. And this is there to be sold. Sold, sold, and sold. There we go. The teddy is... Can be sold as well. Pants as well. This thing can be identified. And that dagger, even if it's a toy sword, pretty funny. Ah, uh, what about this one? One-handed. Earth damage. Is it good? Is it bad? What is it? It's good. Okay. It doesn't have any crit. Uh, dual wielding. Nah, it would be better altogether. That is just so good. Uh, but I think I have to get myself a slightly different weapon for that. Uh, the student describes an amulet that stores source within the gems garnishing its face. One page is particularly eye-catching. In all cases, it must be worn about the neck. It then stores source energies its wearer would otherwise be unable to accumulate. Such occasions include, but are not limited to, extracting source from a living being or spirit and consuming a source orb. Interesting. So something worn on the head that uh, takes out the source of its victims. Very interesting. All right, now, um, I just need Fain to be a somewhat sneaky fellow. Let's see. Na 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 na. The puppet looks at you with what almost a... Yeah, 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 yeah. That's not what you want, is it? Uh, I want him to... Positively haunting there we go. Positively haunting. <laughs> yeah, that's one way of calling it. So, let's see. Get everything on. Uh, 
Ooh, how did that even work? All right, anyway, we're good. Uh, and I took something that has like no interest to us. I want you to get, well, I should go to, uh, towards, also towards others, like it's a theory tool. Why are we so bloody slow? That's the thing that annoys me a wee bit. Slowly, slowly. No alarm, no nothing. Okay, let's pick that lock. The desk is locked tight. Instead of a keyhole, there's a gilded inlay that bears an engraving. It was all for you. Beneath this sits a framed square of blank parchment. Hmm, okay. Uh, you've read about designs such as this before. Password must be written on the blank parchment in order to unlock the you desk. You take a nearby quill and dip it into an inkwell. Then you poise its tip over the framed square of parchment. Okay, so either it's Divine or Lucian, uh, probably not Aru, maybe Darling, it could be Sanders as well, but so either it's Darling, uh, let's see, hmm, it was all for you, for you, for you, for you, for you, Lucian. The black ink turns blood red as it touches the parchment. A burst of energy shoots out from the desk and shocks you. Well, that was the wrong one. <laughs> um... So it's not, uh, it's not Lucian. Um, it could be Darlings. Rudolph. Yeah, why not? He does love his dolls, right? So it's not about the, 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 the desk. That's just a distraction. Uh, it's the actions that count. And he does definitely love his dolls. So, Darlings. The black ink turns blood red as oh. it touches the parchment. Okay, so this is also not it. Um, hmm. Could it be? Probably not divine. Or maybe he's a really cheeky fellow and uses the word password. The black ink turns blood red. As it uh, okay, so it's not password. So what could it be? I'm just going to brute force my way through this. Why not? But it would be better to maybe read up on a book or so. Some of his. To diaries or whatever. Maybe you should have stolen from him before and then the whole thing would be a bit easier. But anyway, um, so it's not Lucian, it's not Darling, it's also not Password. Uh, it could also just be Sanders. And then we go for Divine or Aru or whatnot. Maybe we don't even know who this Aru fellow the black is. black ink turns blood red. Okay. Do we even have the right password to choose from? Right? Like, how do we even know that our selection is correct at all? That one of those words is the correct one. Hmm. Okay. So it's not Sanders, it's not Password, uh, it's also not Darling or Lucian. What about Divine? The black ink turns blood red as it touches the parchment. Okay, then there's only one more option to be found here, and it's Aru. Okay. Aru, Aru, Aru. What is your connection to Aru then? It's kind of funny that Aru is the last one to, and then I can choose from, and it's somehow, whatever. The black ink turns blood red as it touches the parchment. A burst of energy. Hmm. Okay. So it's none of them. That's kind of weird. Maybe I have to find the right thingy for it first. It's not Divine, it's not Lucian, it's not Sanders, it's not Darling, it's not Arrow. It's also not Password. Huh. Looks like we're actually somewhat screwed now. Mm. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see if we found anything at least now. I need to look into some kind of books for this. Uh, could be in the cupboard. All right. Nah. I 
I am alive. I am happy. Play with me. <laughs> oh, Plex. Alarm! Alarm! Intruder! Alarm! Fix Papa! <laughs> we got ourselves a nice dead spot. This is where you can just stay and nothing seems to happen. Ugh. <gasps> you gotta be kidding me. This really is a dead spot. Okay, is there maybe a way to get the uh, source out of these things? What if we were to bless those creatures? Target is out of sight. Yeah, everything in here is out of sight. Come on. Alarm, alarm. What are you doing here? This is mm. private. Alarm. Is he hiding something? I'm hiding is my desire to teach a trespasser a lesson, and I'm doing an increasingly poor job of it. Now, arms. Okay. Mm hmm. How do you do this? I mean, I could just fight this dude, right? But. It kind of feels wrong <laughs> because we are basically just going about um, looking through his stuff and whatnot in the hopes that we can find something, of course. But huh, how can you do this? The Stardust Hub stuff goes in here. No, wait, there's a normal Stardust Hub. There we go. Uh, that is beast thing, beast, 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 and that is, nah, bollocks, that's actually red prince, that one can be sold as well, can be sold as well, that's like crafty thing again, and don't know about that one, but that one goes to the beast too, lockpicks are for me actually, if anything. Ah, too bad Fane doesn't have enough strength. Uh, there's an ornate chest. Maybe there's something in there. Or maybe I have to sneak up on them um, and take something out of those. Maybe this is how it's done. Like some kind of um, energy core so that you have to interact with. That's just a wee bit too many of those. No, it's not working. Here. This is private. Hmm. Well, oh, that must have gotten lost. You got lost. What are you really doing up here? <sighs> it's not going to work. An interloper. I won't stand for this. Hmm. How do I get? Wait. I do know how to get out of this. The teleport. Ah, <laughs> oh, bollocks! How, 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 how do you do this? Uh Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I th think I could actually try something. Mm. Let's see. Uh, let's move this guy up here. And this one right next to it. Okay. Let's just quickly save. See what happens if I want to move forward. Now, okay, I can pass through, but what about the others? Can they pass through me as well? I don't know. You're positively haunting me with your pre Right, now. How do I get about this? Uh, and how do I do it uh, in the most positively manner at all? Hmm. I need to open this ornate chest. Meaning that I have to get past these creatures. Uh... And somehow this is the only way to not get seen. Maybe you can stand right next to this uh, thingamajig over here. But I think I could try to use the teleporting pyramid to do that. Yeah, why not? We're just going to charge forward. Bleh. 
Out of here, out of here, out of here. Run. Come on. Go, 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 go. <laughs> okay. We got it. Um, so, let's see. What is this thing again? Dog chewing toy. That's not what we need. So, finger the little bit of gold. That's nothing of interest to us, actually. And another toy thingy. Hmm. Okay, there definitely is something up there. I uh, just have to figure out a way to get past this guy. So, let's get rid of this. Um, 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 password needed. Or password toy maker. Maybe there's a different way of getting that password, but... Now we are just out of there without us getting into too much trouble. Let's also just sell all of our items that we have just found. <laughs> like every time like one in-game hour passes, this dude has better and better gear to sell. <laughs> uh, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Another thing I need to do is uh, find a way to get Stardust herb somewhere. Alright. Two. Now, where is my gold? I got them in the wrong order, though. Let's move this to me. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. That's the right order. Okay. Then, let's just have a little talk to these fellows on the market. They're just normal citizens. Yeah, take your leave. More protectors. Marksmen, whatnot. And... Paladin healer and so on and so forth. Wait a minute. Uh, I wanted to get the items down here. There was a ring in here. Let's just hope that the game still wants us to get this ring. Thank you. Alrighty. And there's of course this pouchy thingy. And... Like, there has to be another way into that building that does not involve us getting detected by the... Uh... Wait, what? You can... Oh, yeah, it's not an instan instance kind of area. It's actually inside of a house. Obviously it is, but... It doesn't always work that way. <coughs> Alright, let's get this out over here. Oh, there's a key! Lucky fight. Hmm... The beast and his magnetic person, Alito. Yes. What's this? I found something. Ooh. Wait. Ooh. Ooh. We actually found something. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, so this is how you get up there. Oh. Fascinating. Alright. Everything in here is like so interconnected. Let's see. Can we get up there without us getting detected? Maybe. Allow, allow, intruder. Uh. Allow, oh. allow, intruder. What are you doing Ooh. here? This is private. Apologies. My eye, oh, yes. you got lost. What are you really doing up here? Oh no, I don't have persuasion high enough in order to make that work. Okay, so maybe, maybe, maybe. Um, I can make it work by like right clicking this guy and clicking on examine, but there's not. Oh, this does the trick. So, claim that you've been tasked by the Ark's authorities to check in on some of this stuff, but um, this is like a six that's needed. Yeah, and I only have five. Actually, is an item that gives you persuasion bonus, but I do not know where it was. <laughs> Uh, it could be uh, persuasion, persuasion, persuasion. Bah, which of those items gives you persuasion bonuses? Like perseverance, maybe persuasion. There we go. It's a necklace. Um. Hmm. Okay. So I could try that. I just need to equip this necklace, and then I should be fine. Good, 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 good. Uh, maybe I should move this necklace also in, uh, come on, into the bag of high-level equipment. 
that the lizard has. So let's see, this is not where it needs to be. There we go. So, because I have our uh, feathery equipment right up here. Uh, and then there's like lucky charm stuff on the other side. And this is just there for the for the ability, really. It has no real use. This is also for the abilities. Abilities, abilities. Most of this is, yeah, okay, the left side is no abilities. Hey, uh, abilities, abilities. Maybe you can play with just an item ability kind of setup. That would be interesting. Anyway, the, what else we got? Why are the leather shoes all of, ah, because they scale with finesse and I don't have any finesse. So, let's see, there's, uh, this was the retribution stuff. That is the bartering stuff that I don't need at the moment. Um, but yeah, then there is the persuasion thing, yeah. Problem is you cannot really look at perseverance, yeah. Like, if you're lucky, you can get some of this stuff. Maybe there's also a ring that gives you persuasion, but I do not expect it to be there. Yeah, rings are usually more combat-oriented, aren't they? Amulets are more fancy when it comes to this. Perseverance. Well, we are getting closer. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So, this one. No, it's not this one. Uh, it's this one. Persuasion. So, there we go. Constitution, Warfare, Hydrosophism, Persuasion. It's actually pretty decent. Um, so, what would we exchange it with? The Majestphalone Gert. Uh, the Living Wall thingy. It got pyrokinetic and geomancy. Okay, we will exchange that. And of course, the resistances and the intelligence. So, uh, when it comes to armor, it's decent. Okay, so this one has more constitution. Though. Whatever. Let's just equip this and hope for the best. So, there we go. Also, uh, just to be clear, uh, I need to... Split that guy up a little bit. So he probably gets targeted first. Oh no. What the? Oh! How does this game even do that all the time? How does it always choose the wrong target? I don't get it. Okay, so it works in this way. Once you get targeted, it makes a selection. Um, what can I do for you? And uh, if the selection is done, then it chooses, I think, the character that you controlled at the moment. There we go. And with a little bit of luck, it's us again. No, it's not. How does that work? Okay. In this case, I have to do um, a strange other technique. And... Um, I have to bring the main character up first, do the talking, and bring the rest of the team up afterwards. So... There we go. Oh, there's something invisible down here. Probably another puppet. But yeah, do we have? Yes. Come on, move it. There we go. Apology! What are you really doing up here? Well, uh, say that what you were doing here is of no concern to him. He'd do well to forget all about this, unless he's on the hunt for trouble. Well, we're not here to threaten him like this. It's more like we are here to save his ass in the long run, so it would be nice for us to get as much information as we can. Say that he's a salesman, isn't he? If he didn't want people perusing his establishment, he should have done a better job of keeping it secure. <laughs> we are getting through the windows. That's not how they do this, but okay. Uh, but in a way, we are also trying to protect him against burglaries by burglaring him first. <laughs> and don't let me catch you here again. Bollocks. Okay, so at least now we know how to get Persuasion 6, which is kind of like a limiting factor in this game. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I actually have to look into the stats and what their maximums might be. Hmm, how am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? Uh, I don't know. I just steal from this guy. Wait a minute. That could, that could work. Why don't we just try this? Like, one last little attempt. Uh. 
half of the city is stealable and the other half is not ah oh, this is so inconsistent ah, especially when there's someone like me who just opens up every little bloody barrel every little chest every little pouch every little everything uh, so let's try this again uh that's golden golden is good there we go okay this is not golden this is not good fairly simple to differentiate but once you are in the pickup spree then it just goes goes ham right um let's talk to him this way and then we are oh 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 unsent letter to your way wait have we ever source amulet replenish source an ancient amulet that contains five jewels ready to be infused with source each blessed with a kiss of astarte oddly enough the sides and face of the amulet look worn all right so what can we uh, what else can we get from this guy i mean we could get the letter amulet and uh, all of the gold while we're at it there we go so let's uh take our leave and run oh and run all right let's get as far away from here as we can it might be good time to look what we have found so that's a really cool amulet replenish source number fuses one out of five hmm so is there a way to uh, charge this thing up again because it only has a use of one out of five now does it count upwards or does it count downwards i think it counts downwards similar to the purging ones but um don't know what to do with that yet so let's keep that safe keep that in let's consider this some kind of quest item even maybe this is used for later all right and then uh, there was this letter that we've got Pavagiora. i know you've never thought much of my endeavors in the world of play but at last i have done something of which you can be proud i your son i myself designed the most important parts of the cathedral in Arx, including the path of blood the city finally had use for my playful spirit and i rose to the occasion if you ever visit you will know there is something of the family sanders that will last long after we ourselves are gone your son Papa Jora. So this might be the password. T. Sanders. Alright. Maybe this is how you have to do this. Now the other question is, um, how do I get up there without getting seen? Alright. So... Papachora. Papachora. Oh, yeah, and then there was this strange ring that I've got. Um, I should definitely not automatically sort my items like this, especially not if the beast. There we go. And a toy shield. That one can be sold. Uh, let's just identify that. Probably not that. Ooh. Huh. Poison resistance. Again. Anything else? Some of the pouch stuff that goes to thing. It's crafting. It can stay here. Just a quick check and we're good. Alright. So, let's try to get up there. Uh, let's see. Oh, we even stay a barrel. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Come on. Move, 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 move. Okay. No alarm yet. Uh, this lock cannot be picked. The desk is locked tight. 
Instead of a keyhole, there's a gilded inlay that yeah, 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 yeah. take a nearby quill and dip it into the motion sensor. Sure, then there we go. Its tip over the framed square of parchment. The ink is absorbed into the yes. parchment until it vanishes. Ah, Somewhere okay. within the desk, a mechanism unlocks with a click. And we got all of the good stuff. Perfect. Now, nah. time to get out of here. So, this is there to be sold. All right. Fane, 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 you're the good guy. Scroll of Atonement. Ooh. Scratched into moth wing parchment with snake venom. This is the fabled scroll of atonement. With this scroll, your sins can be absolved in the eyes of the divine. Hmm. That might be a very useful thing. Let's just move this to us. Medium earth essence. That's a beast thing. That's for us again. And... Uh, So, that, yeah, I don't, I don't use daggers. I don't even need to look at them. Ah, uh, what about that one? Oh. Mm, so good. Such nice staves. Problem is, staff use is a bit annoying because, um, like the wand can be used as a ranged weapon uh, and uses auto attacks, but the stuff itself is a melee weapon and uh, it can only be used on range if you use the ability Stuff of Magnus, which kind of works like a ranged ability. Um, like it turns the stuff into a ranged weapon, but it can only be used once, not multiple times. That's the iffy bit. So if you have a choice between like a Stuff and once, go for the Stuff. Uh, go for the Stuff. Go for the once, <laughs> because the ones may even be the better solution overall. Mm. But yeah, or yeah, yeah. Uh, the other way would be for you to um, choose, let's say, scroll usage, which I definitely don't do at all. And that's the iffy bit. Anyway, Jora is the password. And uh, in order to get this normally, actually, yeah, to get it selected, you need to read the paper and uh, you get to, you actually need to steal this uh, letter from him. Otherwise, there's no way for you to do this. But anyway. Uh, I think we actually did a pretty decent job for that. Let's get rid of that. All of the other items may not be as useful here. It's just normal stuff to steal, so let's just ignore that for now. And yeah, then there is the... Uh, some, some harbor stuff down there. And of course, this other building. Let's just get ourselves into place. Why not? Uh, there we go. This Voss fellow is definitely something for another time. I think I am... Yeah, I consider this is like one huge area also. And then there's like another one, another one, another one. Hmm. Yep. One house at a time. <laughs> Until next time, then like and subscribe and... Ta-ta!